<risa> Ronaldinho Soccer. Today we're not only playing Mundial Ronaldinho Soccer 64, we're also learning about the origin of the meme, the origin of the game, then playing the game. So we're gonna go through all of that today, chat. That's the goal of today's stream. Um, I personally grew up playing international superstar soccer like crazy, and I, and, I, and I loved it. You know, the normies, the virgin normies were playing FIFA. Real chads, real chads were playing international superstar soccer 64. And the real chads in Brazil were playing Ronaldinho soccer, Mundial Ronaldinho soccer 64. First, you might be confused, and you might be wondering, Scorchy, what the heck is Ronaldinho Soccer 64 anyway? And as you might see, Mundial Ronaldinho Soccer 64 opening is a meme because it has an entry to knowyourmeme.com. That's how you know something is a meme, right? Let's read a little bit about this. Mundial Ronaldinho Soccer 64 opening refers to the opening animation of Mundial Ronaldinho Soccer 64. How would you have guessed? A bootleg Brazilian version of the 1996 Nintendo 64 video game International Superstar Soccer 64, which has a banger of a soundtrack. And it's great. Great game. My childhood, right there. Then, starting in May 2020, that, that's as recent as 10 days ago, the opening has been subject to numerous remixes and parodies, often appearing as a bait and switch punchline. What is this, a meme? All right, so that's it. That's the the intro to the original game. That's International Superstar Soccer, and I'm guessing this is Ronaldinho Soccer? <laughs> Ronaldinho Soccer! Why do they have him laughing like that? Ah ha 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 ha! Ronaldinho Soccer! Well, first of all, we don't even know if that's Ronaldo. First of all, the player is Ronaldo. This is Ronaldo. But he says Ronaldinho. But he's Ronaldo. Ronaldinho is the guy with the curls. On April 6, 2020, Twitter user the De De SM posted a clip of the intro animation to Twitter with the video gaining 200 views. In the following week, they went on to use the clip as a response to a number of tweets. All right, let's see. Is this the OG, the original? Bro. This is the original meme. DSM, did he know what he was getting into? Oh god, that's so loud. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Why did this get attention? This is this is a part of summer humor that I don't get. Why did this get attention? I love the haircut. What do you guys think? Would you would you get this haircut? This guy's a world champion. He won the World Cup with this haircut. He really did try. He really did try to make it happen. Props to him, but listen, man, I'm gonna be honest. <laughs> I'm, gonna be, I'm gonna be real honest with you. Uh, that's what, what I find crazy about Zoomer Humor, that they didn't have a Nintendo 64, but they, they found this and they're like, haha, funny, make it a meme. On April 11th, 2020, YouTube user Love to Gain uploaded the clip with the upload gaining over 10,000 views in one month. Why? In April 12th, Twitter account Ronaldinho N64 was created, posting a single tweet containing the video. Is this true? Oh my god, it exists. Ronaldinho Soccer 64, 377 followers, one single tweet. And that's it, it's just the intro. Ha ha ha, Ronaldinho Zucker. That's it. But that still it's not like meme level. When did the meme stuff really happen? On April 14th, 2020, user Zbrongis posted a bait and switch meme based on a clip from Animal Crossing New Horizons that ended with the Mundial Ronaldinho Soccer 64 intro. The post received 1,700 retweets and 46,000 likes, with the video ac accumulating 62,000 views. This I actually saw. I think this was my first exposure to soccer, to Ronaldinho Soccer 64, it was this meme. All 
I have so many questions. How did we go from a guy just randomly posting the clip to this meme to what we have today? The format did not see major spread until May 1st. User Chef made posted a bait and switch meme based on the cooking scene from Garden of Words. What is Garden of Words? The post received after ele over 11,000 retweets. Why does anime food look so good and it's aesthetically pleasing? All right, May 1st, let's see it. What is this? Why, why, how is this? <laughs> Ronaldinho soccer! <laughs> how is that? <laughs> half a million views, how, how, how? Guys, I just, can someone in chat understand? Like, can someone in chat... Does someone in chat understand? Alright, so... What's the origin of Ronaldinho Soccer 64? Okay, so let's talk about this for a second, because... We also need to understand where the game comes from! And why! So, real quick... Some people say this may possibly be the strangest Nintendo 64 game ever. Why? Ronaldinho Soccer 64 was a bootleg Nintendo 64 game developer, developed by TEG Peru and released only in Brazil back in January of 1998. TEG Peru is best known for making hacks for a variety of different consoles, but this was their one and only Nintendo 64 effort. So it's, it's a ROM hack. And it is a ROM hack of the Konami's International Superstar Soccer 64, which is a banger of a game. It has a few differences. Made included a new Portuguese announcer, so the announcer is now Portuguese. International Superstar Soccer 64 was actually sold in Brazil, but it was the exact same version that was released in North America. This Ronaldinho game was likely their attempt at making a game that was better localized for Brazil. That and to make a quick buck. So TEG Peru didn't have any permission from Konami to do this. I just ripped off the game and tried to make more money. All right, so at the beginning, apparently they removed the Konami logo. They replaced it with a photo of Ronaldo, or Ronaldinho in this case. Then it has a different startup sequence, which we already saw with the famous ha 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 Ronaldinho soccer. And this is a very important part. When we advance to the main menu, we'll hear that the background music in the menu is different. I've gone through all the menus and the only different thing I noticed is that they actually added real player names. So International Superstar Soccer, because it wasn't a FIFA game, it didn't have the rights to use the names from the teams, from the actual players in the teams. So Brazil had made up names like Da Silva, Gomez, Souza, just normal like random ass names. Wow. Uh, Ronaldinho Soccer 64 because it was like completely illegal. It did have Ronaldo, so here he's Ronaldo, but in the game he's Ronaldinho. What? Rivaldo, who was also on the team at the time, so all of them are there. It's not just for Brazil, they did it for all the teams. International Superstar 64 lacked the license to use the real names. There we go. So the hackers actually put the names for all the teams at the time. That was crazy. That's crazy. I've actually gone ahead and I have downloaded a ROM of Mundial Ronaldinho Soccer 64. What are we going to do now? We're going to boot it up. We're going to play it. We're going to see what's up. And then we're going to compare it to International Superstar Soccer 64, which is a superior version. Are you guys ready for this? Here we go. Options, full screen. Oh! This is brought to you by the letter A. <laughs> oh, major A production, never mind. <laughs> never mind. Oh, we got a little intro. Look at the, the flat audience. Oh, those models. It's like in real life. All right. He, oh, here. He's going to say the thing. <laughs> ah, ha, 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 ha. Ronaldinho soccer. Press start. All right. We're pressing start, boys. 
This controller pack contains... Ooh! Ooh, wait a second! Wait a minute! Okay, so we can do an open game. Uh, we can do penalty kicks, PK. Uh, we can do international. I don't know what that is. Scenario, training, world league, options. Wow. Let's do an open game. Let's just go for it. Me versus CPU. I'm pretty sure I can do it. All right, obviously we have to play as Brazil. Let's go against England. What? Condition? Good? I don't know. I feel good right now. <laughs> How about you guys? You know what? I also feel strong. I don't know what that does, but I'm, I'm gonna make my opponent also feel good and strong. We can go to South, Af South American, SA Main Stadium, African Stadium, Asian Stadium, Euro International Stadium, Euro Center Stadium. Why do Europe get? Why does Europe get two two stadiums? All right, who we got on our team? We got Ronaldo. <laughs> the goalkeeper on the other team is called Seaman. <laughs> Oh, David Beckham is in it! Look at that, number 11! David Beckham! See, man with an A. I don't know what you're talking about. Brazil contra Inglaterra! They, they cut it off. He didn't even say Inglaterra. He said Inglaterra! Uh, do we want to go... We're going to go left to right. Yeah, sure. Oh, sh They start? Oh, f*** it. Wait, wait, what do I do? Press B, press B! Oh, f I killed him! Sorry, you you foul already. No! Oh, the save, dude. This is amazing gameplay, right? There. Oh no! Catch it! Oh f no no no! I actually have no. Oh, I got the ball! I got the ball! Not you, I do. How do how do I run? Why is it so quiet? I need I need some Brazilian music. Game continue. Where is Beckham? Where's Ronaldo? All right, pass, pass. Oh. Dude, I'm so good at this game. So good. Oh! Illegal! Kill him, buddy. Kill him. Kill buddy. Here, here. We're going for the goal. Do it! Oh! Goal kick! He touched it! Oh, no. He didn't touch it. I love how they left the Konami logos at the border of the stage. Buddy, my brother. No. This British team is not very great. Sorry to say that to the British viewers. EU get... Oh! Illegal again! Incel! It was the incel! Dude, don't trust incels. You see his name? Oh, dude, if I don't score as Ronaldo, I'm gonna be so salty. Give it, give it, give, give it to Ronaldo. Woof! Oh! Oh! No! Shoot it! Guys, I swear I'm good at this game. We're gonna get one goal as Ronaldo. We need to, for the subs. You guys wanted to see this. The ultimate meme is me taking Ronaldo, shooting... Oh, damn it! Wow, look at Ronaldo right now at the top of the screen. He looks like a f***ing alien. <laughs> what the hell? Half time. Look, we did 18 shots, no goals. <laughs> God damn, that's an awful... That's an awful, awful, awful number. The only meme that I accept now is winning this match with a goal from Ronaldo. We're doing it, boys. Inglaterra! No! No, don't score, bitch! Why was the goalkeeper, like, leaning down? What is this? Is the ref blind? What is... Look, 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 look! He's literally glitching through me. That can't be legal. FIFA does not have rules about glitching through people. Oh! Why does Ronaldo suck so goddamn much? Got him. Oh, here we go. We're gonna win the World Cup, boys. La bola! Hey! Oh, you know what? Ha ha ha! Ronaldinho sucker! By Rivaldo with the Ronaldo assist. It counts? Does it count? See, Ronaldo with the assist? Eh? Eh, Rivaldo sucker! Ha ha ha! Oh my god, what player was that? No! No! I'm so mad right now. But here we go. Ronaldo! Ronaldo! Can I, can I kill? Oh! Oh no! Oh no! I killed the goalkeeper! I killed Seaman! I killed him! I, I killed Seaman! 
No, 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 please don't, 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 please, dude, no, 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 okay, yellow card, good, 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 whew, 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 whew. yellow card, that's okay, that's okay, Brazil, Brazil, can someone shoot it, was it Ronaldo, Ronaldo, ha, 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 Ronaldinho soccer, let's go, let's go Ronaldinho soccer baby we did it the meme the meme has found f full closure or whatever we did it boys a goal with Ronaldo in Ronaldinho soccer now we just gotta seal the match now we just gotta well fin the juego end of the game fin del juego we tried boys please put an f in the chat we lost we score with ronaldo haha <laughs> ronaldinho soccer but we fall 3-2 against the british 46 shots no goals i think i need to practice this game i don't know how it works <laughs>